Hi and welcome to my channel. In this video, I'll be unboxing a late 2015 iMac. Let's get unboxing! Luckily the eBay seller was kind enough to provide a box. On eBay, this iMac was only £500. Personally, I thought it was a great deal, so I bought it. This gorgeous Retina 4K display has over 9 million pixels. This is the first 4K iMac I've ever owned. It's got a 3.1 GHz Intel quad core i5, 8 GB of RAM, and a 1 TB hard drive. First things first, I need to access the hard drive. Using a pry tool from my iFixit kit, I carefully separate the adhesive from the display. When I open the iMac, I have to remove two cables from the board. I can then open the iMac like a book. I then peel off the adhesive strips. This iMac was very dusty. Using my dust brush, I was able to remove dust accumulating in the fan. Now it's time to remove the hard drive. Using a torque screwdriver, I was able to remove the four screws holding the hard drive in place. You know, it's amazing what an SSD can do. This SSD will be miles better in performance. The installation of the SSD was pretty straightforward. Next I had to reattach the brackets using the four screws. Using the corresponding guides, I was able to attach the strips to the iMac, ensuring that they are in the right place. The strips go from one to five clockwise. Personally, I don't need any help from iFixit for this, as it's very simple to do. Okay, so now it's time to remove the adhesive. Before I close the iMac for good, I make sure that it actually works. On my screen, I can now see a flashing folder icon. This is good. This means the SSD has worked. Using an iFixit microfiber cloth, I was able to remove any marks on the display. Now to install macOS Big Sur. And I'm done. If you've enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.